Hello and welcome to The Print. I'm Akanksha Mishra and this is Scientifix where I will be taking you through this week's top science news from across the world. Our first query today is about how scientists have found that your thumbs may reveal more about your brain than you think. A new study of 94 primate species including both fossils and living animals by the University of Reading shows that species with relatively longer thumbs tend to have bigger brains. Published in the Communications Biology Journal, the research is the first direct evidence that nimble hands and bigger brains evolved together across the primate family, from lemurs all the way to humans. Even when scientists removed humans from the equation, the link between thumb length and brain size held firm. Lead author Dr. Joanna Baker from the University of Reading said in a press release that as our ancestors got better at gripping and manipulating objects, their brains had to expand to keep up. Interestingly, the study found longer thumbs were tied not to the movement centers in the brain, but to the neocortex, which is the region behind thinking, planning and consciousness. This reflects a relationship between dexterity in our hands and advanced cognitive skills. Next up, a team of astronomers led by the University of Galway have captured a rare glimpse of a planet still in its infancy orbiting a young star that's similar to our sun. Named Wispit-2b, the planet is about 5 million years old, which is a blink of an eye when you look at it in cosmic time. Initial observations say that it's likely to be a gas giant planet comparable in size to Jupiter. The discovery, which was published in Astrophysical Journal Letters, was made using European Southern Observatory's Very Large Telescope in Chile. Researchers initially spotted a striking multi-ringed dust disk around the star, before detecting the young planet glowing in near-infrared light. This is because the planet is still so young that it's glowing and very, very hot, and most of the light that it's emitting is in infrared. It's only the second confirmed planet ever detected at such an early age of formation and the first within a multi-ringed disk. Scientists say that WISPIT-2b now offers a unique laboratory to study how planets are born and how they evolve. A planet is truly born and scientists have seen it. For our next story, ecologists in Taiwan have discovered a rare predatory trick a nocturnal spider that uses trapped fireflies as bait to use their glow and lure more prey in. The sheet web spider, which is called Securus clavis, was observed by scientists catching fireflies and leaving them alive in its web, where they continued to glow for up to an hour. This bioluminescence then attracted fresh prey. To try this in an experimental format, Researchers placed LED lights to mimic fireflies in webs and they found that these lights drew three times more insects than normal webs without lights. In fact, when they looked at how many fireflies got caught specifically due to the lights, the number rose tenfold as compared to normal webs. The majority of the glowing victims were male, which were likely mistaking the lights for potential female mates. Published in the Journal of Animal Ecology, the study reveals how spiders sometimes exploit their prey's own mating signals to boost their success in hunting, without expending any of their own energy on bioluminescence. This work, according to the paper, highlights a previously undocumented interaction in the complex evolutionary game of predator and prey. Finally, the air turbulence in flights is set to worsen in the coming decades as climate change disrupts the stability of the atmosphere, according to new research. Using 26 global climate models, scientists studied how rising temperatures alter the jet stream, which are fast-flowing air currents at around 35,000 feet where most planes cruise. These jet streams are the reason for many plane routes being the way they are, and they are also the cause of turbulence when it happens when we are in a flight. The study published in the Journal of Atmospheric Sciences predicts that wind shear will rise by 16 to 27 percent 
and atmospheric stability will fall by 10 to 20 percent between 2015 and 2100. Together, these shifts create prime conditions for clear air turbulence, which are the sudden invisible jolts that can violently shake an aircraft without warning. The paper said that pilots may face more frequent and severe turbulence, while co-author Professor Paul Williams warned that airlines will need new technology to detect it. While turbulence is already costing US carriers up to $500 million a year, scientists say that the skies could soon become even rougher. That's all we have for you today. Thank you for tuning into The Print.